Udo Latek, a football legend, as popular as he was incomparable. Germany's most successful club coach ever died on February the 1st. He was 80 years old. He was always a nice and very likable person, and it's sad he's no longer with us. A fantastic character and an absolutely top coach. It's certainly a sad moment. He was a really, really great coach. A gifted tactician and an empathetic communicator, Udo Latek left an indelible mark on German football. He was a passionate ambassador for the sport he loved. He was an incredible character and a genuine one. Mouthing platitudes was never his thing. There was always a real substance to him. I thought he was great. I had a pretty simple equation for the players. I said, lads, if you play well and win every Saturday, we don't need to train during the week. But woe betide you if you don't play well, because then I'll tear you apart. It was a line that always served me well. Under Latek, Bayern, Mönchengladbach and Barcelona all stocked up their trophy cabinets in the 1970s and 80s. In total, he led them to 14 national and European titles. He was a true great, our most successful coach ever in Germany, maybe one of the most successful anywhere. The bulk of that success was with Bayern. Latek won six of his eight Bundesliga titles and three DFB Cups in his two stints at the helm in Munich. In 1974, he also led Bayern to their first European Cup triumph. Udo Latek, an exceptional coach and personality with a simple recipe for success. All good coaches teach their players to score more goals than their opponents. In the year 2000, the 65-year-old Latek stepped into the breach at Dortmund, six weeks from the end of the season. With Matthias Sammer at his side, he hauled them clear of relegation. That job rounded off an outstanding career. When he came, he deflected everything onto himself, the media, the fans. He took the pressure off the team, which was an enormous help. In 2013, as the Bundesliga marked its 50th anniversary, Latek was given an honorary award for his lifetime's work. The news of his passing triggered a flood of tributes from the world football community. Barcelona posted a memorial tweet for their former coach, as did Mönchengladbach, Dortmund and Bayern. Franz Beckenbauer also turned to Twitter to express his sadness, along with World Cup winners Lukas Podolski, Thomas Müller and Benedikt Hervedus. If they play football in heaven, it's going to be successful football from now on. German football has lost one of its true all-time greats. Udo Latek, rest in peace.